More than just an upgrade every September, the Apple Watch sees a refresh, and in 2025, that refresh takes the form of the Apple Watch Series 11. But this isn't just another yearly upgrade. According to leaks and early reports, Apple is aiming to push its smartwatch into entirely new territory. The Apple Watch Series 11 is not just thinner or sleeker, it's smarter, it's faster, and far more aware of your body, your surroundings, and your routine. This year, we're seeing Apple shift from passive tracking to active guidance with AI Driven. Features on-device health analysis and new levels of connectivity. Let's dive into the most detailed breakdown of the Apple Watch Series 11. Starting with what truly powers this next-gen wearable, the brand new S11 chip, the powerhouse. T. Meet the S11 chip the Apple Watch Series 11 is expected to be powered by Apple's S11 chip reportedly built using a 3 nanometers or even a groundbreaking 2 nanometers fabrication process. That means more transistors packed into a smaller, more efficient space. The result, chip that consumes less power, generates less heat, and delivers significantly more performance. Apps will open instantly. Animations will look smoother. You'll experience a noticeable boost in responsiveness across the board. But the real story here isn't just speed its intelligence. The S11 chip is designed to bring Apple intelligence, Apple's new and device AI system directly to your wrist. This means smarter suggestions, faster Siri responses, and personalized feedback, all processed locally. No cloud lag, no privacy compromises. Imagine finishing a workout and instantly hearing you hit your target pace. Burn 480 calories, and maintained your heart rate in the endurance zone for 20 minutes. Consider a 250 milliliters water intake and a three minute cool down. All of that processed and delivered instantly without even saying, hey Siri. Redefining connectivity. Apple's first custom 5G modem until now. Apple watches have used Qualcomm. Modems for cellular functionality. But that may change with Series 11. Rumors suggest Apple is introducing its very first in-house 5G modem built specifically for wearables. It supports a type of low power. Low latency 5G, known as RedCap, perfect for devices like the Apple Watch. This upgrade isn't about ultra-fast downloads. It's about reliable, battery-efficient connectivity. You'll be able to stream Apple, music, send messages, make calls, and access cloud services like Find My and Siri, even without your iPhone nearby. Real-time location tracking could even work more seamlessly in emergencies. Series. Levin aims to be more independent. Your iPhone becomes optional. It's not essential. The AI experience coaching in real-time Apple intelligence, enabled by the S11 chip, transforms the Apple Watch into a proactive assistant. One of its biggest strengths is real-time coaching. Think beyond generic alerts. This is data-backed feedback that learns your patterns and adapts to you. If your recovery heart rate is slower than usual, it may gently prompt you to take a lighter workout. If stress levels spike, detected by subtle heart rate and motion changes, it could suggest a two-minute breathing exercise. If sleep quality declines over a few nights, it may recommend an earlier bedtime or reduced screen time. All of this happens on device with privacy preserved and speed enhanced. Health features. A medical toolkit on your wrist health remains at the center of the Apple Watch series. 11 in 2025 could mark the debut of one of its most requested features. Non-invasive. Blood pressure monitoring. Using optical sensors and pulse timing, the series 11 may estimate systolic and diastolic values without the need for cuffs or doctor visits. Even if it's not as precise as clinical-grade tools, the feature could detect rising trends, potentially. Giving early warnings for hypertension or cardiovascular stress, alerts like blood pressure slightly elevated could prompt users to take a break or track patterns over time. Another potential return is blood oxygen monitoring. Following legal challenges that affected availability in some regions, Apple may reintroduce this feature with new algorithms or redesign sensors that avoid patent issues. This vital metric helps track breathing efficiency, high altitude adaptation, and early illness symptoms futures. Glucose monitoring 
and Marapal. It's also laying the groundwork for another medical milestone, non-invasive glucose monitoring. While full clinical grade accuracy may not arrive in 2025, the Series 11 could offer trend-based alerts. A nudge like your glucose levels rose 15% after lunch could guide pre-diabetic users to test further or adjust their meals. Unified. Dashboard. From data to guidance, the Series 11 won't just collect health data, it will interpret it. The watch face will show priority stats like heart rate, activity rings, and stress levels. One tap reveals detailed summaries, while the health app on iPhone will offer trend analysis, history, and exportable reports, a new standard for wearables. Apple Watch Series 11 might be the most transformational smartwatch since the original. It's faster, smarter, and more helpful. It does more with fewer taps. It runs AI tasks locally. It helps you act, not just observe. Battery life. Small gains. 8. Big results battery life is one area where Apple has historically played it safe. But with Series 11, we could see incremental but meaningful improvements thanks to the efficient. S11 chip and watchOS 12 optimizations. Apple may market the Series 11 with the same 18-hour all-day battery life. But in practice, users could see 20 to 22 hours under regular use. Pricing and model. Variance Apple is likely to maintain its current pricing structure. The base Series 11 model, aluminum case with GPS, is expected to start at $399. The GPS Plus cellular variant could begin at $499. Stainless steel models may start at $699. With higher end bands and materials pushing that closer to $1,000. There may also be new ultra band bundles or fitness focused additions. A Series 11 performance bundle might include the rugged band and exclusive workout watch faces. Apple may also expand family setup options for children and elderly users. With simplified software modes, expect pre-orders to begin shortly after Apple's September keynote. With deliveries arriving mid to late September, older series models will likely drop in price or phase out, especially the Series 8 and 9. Final thoughts. The watch that watches over UAPL watch series. 11 is shaping up to be Apple's most holistic upgrade since the Series 4. It's not flashy for the sake. A flash it's meaningful. Every enhancement, from faster chips to smarter AI to health innovation, centers on making the watch more useful, more intuitive, more indispensable. For fitness buffs, it's a better coach. For health-conscious users, it's a better monitor. For everyday consumers, it's a better companion. And in 2025, when AI and privacy are both high on consumers' minds, the Series 11 offers both. It brings future-ready features into a package that's already loved by millions. The Apple Watch isn't just evolving, it's leading. Stay subscribed to Educational Hub for more deep dives into the world of wearables, Apple leaks, and tech innovation. Until next time, keep exploring.